A routine traffic stop on I-40 gives us a look at one of the ways that drugs are flooding into our state. As a state police officer's video shows, the contraband was not hard to uncover. A driver on the side of I-40 insists to officers no tiene, uh, drogas ilegales. there are no illegal drugs in his car. Heurina. No, man. <laughs> But officers soon learn that is not the case. The driver, identified as Manuel Pinon Duran, pulls over for a New Mexico State Police officer in Cibola County last month, even before any lights or sirens. What's going on, sir? Oh, the hood came up. The officer and the driver of the Honda continue the conversation in Spanish. Tienes licencia, registración. In his ID? Pinon Duran tells the officer he's headed to Albuquerque. The officer learns Pinon Duran is from Mexico and doesn't have a driver's license. After issuing Pinon Duran a citation, the officer brings out a canine to help them search the car, expecting to find drugs when they pop the trunk. They think they may have zeroed in on the hiding spot. That's been with a little bit. Officers first try to pry the spare tire off the wheel, then go to work slicing it off the wheel. When they finally cut the tire all the way open, no, no drugs. Turns out what they were looking for was sitting in plain sight in the back seat. Right here, the duffel bag. A duffel bag, investigators say, was filled with more than eight pounds of meth, turning a traffic citation into a federal drug trafficking charge. According to the officer's report, he originally pulled over Pinon Duran for following another car too closely. Pinon Duran has been convicted three times for entering the country illegally.